We were about to set off to dart the last eight rhinos. We're moving 16 uh, southern white rhino to Garamba um, in the DRC. Started half a year ago when we caught them, quarantined them, held them for a holding period of nearly six months. This translocation really is a story of hope. This fantastic opportunity to create new founder populations, reverse local extinctions and destination out of a continually producing population it really is one of the most remarkable conservation victories. A lot of things happening. We have cranes busy swapping loaded crates for crates that are empty, helicopters that are refueling, keeping the gears turning. There haven't been rhinos in Garamba for 16 years. Adding rhino back again into that ecosystem is an important part of balancing that whole ecosystem. This is a complex operation. It's been incredibly courageous of African parks to take on a project of this magnitude. It's incredibly expensive, it's dangerous, but it's key. If there's no one protecting habitat, then species will disappear all across the planet. And an opportunity like this is the objective. It's to spread the genetic pool and to spread the risk that these animals are under. In the space of two hours, we immobilized and loaded each one of those rhinos into the crates followed by a four-hour journey to King Shark International Airport at Durban. And then a 12-hour flight to Doko in northeastern part of DRC. Returning rhinos back to Garamba is really, really important, not just to us, but of course to the local people. The last part of the journey was a four-hour truck journey into the park itself. And the communities, the local leaders, they're very excited to see this iconic species back. Rhinos were offloaded within 15 minutes. We were ecstatic to see that they were still in great condition. A total of a 30 hour translocation, which is long in terms of rhino translocations. On vient de remettre sur pied une espèce qui était disparue, mais aujourd'hui on le remet en place pour que effectivement ça puisse donner de la valeur à la fois au niveau du parc, mais aussi au niveau de. Uh, du pays et pourquoi pas au niveau international. It's a move of global significance. It's going to shine a very, very positive light on this part of the DRC. Our hope is that 10 or 20 years from now, there's a thriving population of uh, white rhinos in Garamba for the benefit of the local people and for the rhinos themselves. <laughs>